Oh, gonna get another copyright claim. I had two on the last bit because the Judas Priest. Uh, these came from, I went to the Pink Floyd, Don, Don Floyd sale today, and I didn't get a lot. I took them some records that I had. Uh, anyway, uh, I got these for 50 cents each. Uh, I don't know why the bat's not working. What's going on, buddy? sure how your guys uh do I break ya? Uh, mm. Never feed the neighbors chickens. They start thinking they're yours. Goldie and what'd they call you, dummy? No. I'm probably gonna get a copyright thing on that music and I'm too lazy to go back and turn it down. It was Tom Petty, one of the records I got. Uh, these are three laser discs. He gave them to me for three bucks a piece. Wayne's World, I made dig out the old laser discs and watch these and then sell them. These two I think I can sell for like 15 or 20 bucks. This is surprisingly not worth much, but it's pretty crease. Terrible. They used the worst artwork for the cover. It's too bad. They might as well just put the actual photos on there. It couldn't have hurt. Uh, but this, two patches from them. Put ten on them for the flea market. Uh, decide to give Gizmo a new home. He can't hang off my porch forever. Oh, don't cry, Gizmo. And my single head that's been on my bathroom shelf because I bro broke his sister or brother. So I felt obligated to hold on to him. Uh, I don't know, I spent like, I had a $50 bill the first run through Don's stuff. And then he gave me 10 for that album, which I should have gotten more in trade because I paid a bunch of money for them records. Uh, anyway, he charged me 5 for this Hunger Games, which... That's probably what I would sell it for, but I also shouldn't have bought it because, well, I thought I could get it off. There was some sticky, like, old tape from a gummy label on these two covers, so now I, I can't get them off. I used a lot of alcohol on them, barely. Now well, that one came off pretty good, but there's still a lot on there. Could have been something building a nest, I suppose. I don't like the fact that that's all fudged up too, the bottoms of these books. I just noticed that. Aww. Well, I got this three books out of Hunger Games trilogy. Then I took and got these many of the Stephen King. Let's see, took and five for that. The records would have been technically, uh, I had ten, two for five bucks. So what's that add up to? Uh, fifty bucks, or, uh, wait a minute. Twenty-five bucks. So there's thirty, and uh, that was separate. The nine dollars for that. Man, I I think I got charged too much. Anyway, I got these Stephen Kings, uh, Dolores Claiborne. Uh, three of these, I think just three of them, are UK releases. So I may list them online. I really didn't look at the tops, and they got an awful lot of spotting on the tops. Gross. Sitting in a shed. Now I gotta figure out if I got overcharged. Hmm. Well, I couldn't think. I thought for sure I got ripped off, but I guess I forgot about comic books. Not all these. These are my 200 comics. Oh yeah. Uh, all right. They had some Simpsons. I put 10 on one and two of the Sim Bartman. Uh, Five dollars on that. Um, Horror, this is the annual number two th or for 2000 and 2001. I put five apiece on them. The Simpsons first issue, this is a newsstand. The original other ones came with a poster. This one did not. Uh, I put 20 bucks on it. That's, I, couldn't remember, I couldn't believe how much they were selling for. I, I don't know. I got rid of all my other ones cheap. Itchy and Scratchy, five bucks. Avengers King Size, number nine, annual, not three bucks. Daredevil, two fifty-two, three dollars. Uh, Fantastic Four, one sixty-seven, two dollars. Probably could ask three. Dead of Night, eight, uh, three dollars. Spectra, uh, annual number one, two bucks. Punisher with Moon Knight, three dollars. That's uh, Punisher annual, or yeah, annual number two. Um, these are all old. So, wait, is that all I got up there? Huh. Seems like I had more of it. And I had one other comic by Basil Wolverton. Uh, it's something... Planet Horror or something. I can't think of it, but it's not worth anything. And my records. Hmm. 
got stung by a dang bee. The only place I don't have a callus on that foot and a bee had to get me. I was walking by my garden. Porch is uh, a little bit better. Still got a big mess over there to finish cleaning out. But we'll go a little bit at a time. One day at a time, sweet Jesus. Oh, uh, this a mess. Uh, well, the records seem to pan out pretty good. Uh, this was a, probably shouldn't bought. I'm only gonna ask five bucks because the wheel's loose somewhere. Where is the wheel? Where's the wheel? The magic wheel should have a pin through it, but it does not. So I'm gonna charge five. It's a good album to look out for. Some of them are very expensive. Uh, Tom Payton Heartbreakers, I put town on there, I was just listening to that, very good shape. This, I knew when I saw it, it was probably worth something, because this, the later Van Halen's would have had lesser albums released, probably more like CDs, so, this is going for, I put, I put 30 on this, it's overall, it's pretty clean. Uh, Billion Dollar Babies, Alice Cooper, it's got the photos, but no, uh, big giant billion, or big bill that comes in the wallet, this was the wallet. Had the sleeve and the photos. There's a photo insert which somebody popped out, but it's in there. Uh, and I got Van Halen, the first album, which I'm going to be playing after Tom Petty. It looks pretty good. Um, probably going to get. I'm going to ask ten, probably just ten bucks for it. It's uh, if the cover is nice. It's in shrink wrap actually, so it's pretty good. And the vinyl's real nice. Uh, this keel, I don't know why I bought it. Gene Salmons produced them. Uh, somebody wrote on it. Uh, I suppose that's a radio station, maybe. Uh, it's just a 12-inch. Had four bucks. I, got, I don't know why I even got The vinyl looks great. It's a promo. Uh, this Monty Python. I haven't never seen it. The instant record collection. <laughs> Cutting the sausage. Anyway, uh... Whoa, I don't know who that is. Uh, Wizards and, or Demons and Wizards, which I think my copy, I had a nice copy, I gave it to my buddy Dan, uh, I'll probably see how bad mine is and probably keep that one. Uriah Heep, Sweet Freedom, I don't know what I'm doing with that, he had two copies of that, the other one was rough looking, this has a flapper. Ooh. Uh, who are you? The who? The one was not to be taken away, and then, uh, Keith Moon died right after that. Um, yeah. I don't know what the real story is with that. So. so there's that, and that will do it, I guess. I did not get anything else. I'll uh, probably get a few things maybe tomorrow. I'll go back through. A lot of it was disappointed because he had so much of the same junk left over from last year. Uh, so, yeah. All right.